Hi everyone! We have been on a break for a little while due to personal stuff and we had to re-evaluate our channel. But we have done that and we're back with twice the power. We're really looking forward to it and we're going right in with FitCon Europe. Welcome to Just Sister Things. We have arrived at VidCon Europe and we're about to head into our first panel. We're so excited. Um, this time it's a little bit different. There's no community track, but we have joined the creator track and we can't wait. So let's go. Hi, yesterday I stood on the stage and I talked to a bunch of industry people about urinals and stuff and that was not great. I, I got some smiles, but I also kind of got the feeling that maybe they weren't expecting me to talk about weird European urinals. On the count of three, I'm going to want us all to raise up a cheer so that way everyone outside can be really jealous of what's going on <laughs> and be really curious about like all the excitement that's happening in here. Okay, so ready? One, two, three. Yeah. All right. Oh, look, we got one person there coming we go. from that. There we go. Thank you. Round. I need you with a mic. One person with a mic right over here. Five seconds to tell a question. How's the baby? How's the baby? Okay. Right. It's awesome. 30 seconds. Okay, next a bit, question. A bit bigger than where he should be right now. Go ahead. If I were uh, making thumbnails that are a little bit more artsy. Artsy thumbnails, go! Faces are more clickable, keep the face on the left side of the screen, use text if possible, and garish colors work. Yes. Go! Terrible colors. Let's dispense an ideal brand to work with. Ideal brand to work with, one that finds a balance between their brand messaging points and uh, your creative vision. And gives you as much creative control as possible. Go! Could Mario Galaxy actually be in the future of Mario Odyssey? No. <laughs> <laughs> No way! Is it a sign that lights up? Yeah. Yeah. No we way! Much, and we made it ourselves. <laughs> no way! Oh, that's awesome! That is really good. Wow. Yes! I thought you were loaded. Yeah, you, you did the wiring yourself? Yep. That's so awesome! Oh, this is great. Thank you. Oh man, we're gonna. If, if ever there's other theory channels, I have to ask you to uh, for tips on how to update the the next two colors. That's okay. incredible. Yes, thank you. Um, you can unwrap those later, but this is just some baby stuff. There's. Are you kidding me? That's so awesome. Thank you. That's so sweet. Oh, little baby pet is so excited. Yeah, He's a little baby boy. Right, I know. Seriously. We just got back from a ton up with Pamela Horton and it was really great. It was all about um, gaming and streaming and doing gaming videos and everything. And um, yeah, with all the people around, they all had great ideas, great advice, great tips on it was everything. It a lot of fun. <laughs> yeah, it was really a lot of fun. Yeah. And now we're going downstairs to get some, uh, some lunch and we'll see you all later. Hey guys. Hello. Hi <laughs> It is now the second day of FitCon Europe. We're very excited, of course. We've already been to two presentations. One from Flatter and one from Matthew and Stephanie Patrick from Game Theory. It was all very interesting and we really liked it. But we're also really tired by now, so we're taking a break and having a little lunch. Am I making 
making it awkward now. <laughs> a few weeks ago, I read a study uh, it, that was done in 2017 on a thousand kids, and they asked them what was their sort of desired career. And do you guys know what the number one response was? YouTuber. YouTuber. Do you guys want my advice? Okay, here it is. Don't do it. Run away. This is not a viable career. I had one responsibility, and only one. This is no joke. I had to set up the chairs before anyone else got there. In all honesty, I don't think president of men's chorus was actually something that existed before I got to high school. I think my choir dress director, Mr. Bianchi, saw me getting there early and my enthusiasm for helping, and he's like, hey, I don't want to set up these chairs myself. You go set up these chairs, Matthew. You're president, congratulations. <laughs> Thanks, Mr. Bianchi. I was like the pity president, basically. <laughs> Wow, just before I was thinking like, oh, I'm okay with my nerves. I don't think I can be any more nervous than that. And then they're like, oh, we're gonna put you after that presentation. It's like, oh, I was wrong. A lot of people seem to have this perception of YouTube as a huge monolithic entity. And you see this reflected when people say stuff like, ah, the, the YouTubers, those guys who play games, right? Or, oh, it's all clickbait and the top, the, the top 10 lists, or ah, it's too crowded, it's impossible to get it. And when I showed this presentation to some people, they were like, did you get those statements from 2012? I got this from Reddit last week. If you're a creator, create a community around yourself that is supportive and positive. If you're just a viewer, then vote with your view. Don't support people or videos who are spewing out that sort of negativity or using that sort of negativity to grow their own presences. You have that power. You vote with your view. All of us, big or small, are influencers in some capacity. Some of us are small influencers with just our friends and family in our lives. And some of us are big influencers who are talking at the scale of millions on a worldwide stage. But regardless of whether you're a small influencer or a big influencer, as an influencer, you have to be a role model and you are setting a tone for the people in your life and the people who listen to you. Uh, that was FitCon Europe. That was FitCon Europe, indeed. Yep. 2018. <laughs> it ended off on a high note, we being mad again and yes. um, with a great keynote. So that was awesome. We're actually, we're really happy with this, that uh, we actually met a lot of fun people. We, yeah, we learned met a lot. <laughs> yes. Uh, totally had my hands on the steering wheel <laughs> anyway you guys that was so much fun we met a tons of new people um, at FitCon we met Matt Pedica we met Pamela Horton and Ian Hancox from Schmash that was awesome and hopefully next year there will be another FitCon that will be amazing and hopefully this time there will be a community track you guys please get yep. the community track back thank you guys so much for watching if you like this video and you want to see more Click that subscribe button and give the little bell a little boop so you get notifications when we have more of these kind of videos exactly. on our channel. And we'll see y'all later! later.